Hello guys, Mel here. Would you like toned legs and firm legs? If it's the case, well, you click on the right video. And make sure you subscribe right here and you click on the bell and that way you're gonna get notified next time I post new videos. So for today's HIIT workout, you're gonna need weights right here. So as light or as heavy as you want, okay? You can also just use your body weight. If you don't have any weights, use can from your pantry. Okay, so let's do a quick warm up and let's get started. Okay, let's go like girls. Good, give me high knees. That's it. Four, three, two, let's open your knees right here. And then I'm gonna go right away into lunges and squats. Again, for four, three, two, ready? Let's go squat, down and up. Contract your glutes. You don't need to go very deep, guys. We're still right in the warm up. Down, contract your glutes. That's it. In four, three, and two. That's it. And release, skater. You can add a little hop. That's it. Again, in four, three, and two. That's it. And release, lunges. We're gonna alternate your legs. Let's go down and down. So bring your abs into your spine. It's gonna help for balance. Shoulders are down, away from your ears. That's it. And again for four, three, and two. Last one. And release, knees up. That's it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Run right here. Kick your butt. Bring your arms up. Four, three, two. That's it, and release. Squat, jump side to side again. I'm just gonna go slow, not jumping too high to start. That's it. Okay, can you jump a little bit higher? Good, that's it. Four, three, two, last one, and release. Let's jog our skipping rope. You do what you want and move your arms. We're almost done here. Four, three, I'm feeling warm already. Two, that's it. Let's go back to skater. Add a little hop. Nice. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. That's it, and release. Step touch. Your heart rate is up. She's warm. Perfect. Okay. Toes are up. Let's inhale. Exhale down. So for today, we're gonna to focus only on your legs. You can use your body weight, add intensity by adding weights. Let's switch your legs, same thing. Get a stretch behind your leg. Two more. That's it, last one. Good, and release, open your legs. Now I want you to bend one knee at a time. It's very ugly outside. It's very gray. You can tell because the screen is not as light. Good, and slowly release. So we're gonna start with the lunge. We're gonna start only with the right. I prefer going back, guys, just like that, okay? If you want intensity, add your weight. I have 15 in each hand. You can have nothing, five, eight, 10 pounds. You decide. 
Are you ready? I'm starting my timer just to give me an idea. There we go. Let's go down and up. Shoulders are down and back. Keep your chest up for me. So emphasize on squeezing slightly your shoulder blades together. That way, you're gonna improve your posture. That's it, oh, I feel it. Perfect. And I want to remind you, how we're gonna do it twice as well. Almost there. That's it. And again, for three, two, last one, and release. March it out. We're gonna switch your legs right away for the left. Let's go, down and up. Good, so I prefer guys you go slow, focus on quality instead of quantity. Good, press your big toes into the floor, keep your knee aligned with your ankle, less than halfway there. Come on, keep your abs tight, abs into your spine. Imagine I'm punching in your stomach, what are you gonna do? You're gonna want to protect. That's the way you should engage your abs. Good, and release, push forward. Put your weights down, high knees, will be your cardio. Ready, go. Woohoo! Come on, bring those knees up. Or you can do a baby one, focus, or think about yourself, guys, listen to your own body. That's it. Move your arms a little bit more. Woohoo! 10 seconds. That's it. And release. And march. There we go. Grab, grab your water. We'll come back. Second set. Okay, we're going to go back. Let's start again with the right leg. Optional to use your weights or your bottle of wine. Ready? Let's go. Oh, I forgot my timer. Let's go, down and up. Perfect timing, thank you timer. Down and up, shoulders are down and back. Lift your chest, look straight ahead, it's gonna help for posture. That's it, whew. Body weight, it's so good for us. And now we have body weight, we have the force of gravity as well, pushing against us. Almost there, come on. Switch it up, march, get ready. We're gonna go with the left leg. Three, two, right here. Let's go, shoulders down and back, abs are tight. Inhale, exhale up. That's it. losing my balance because I look at my timer. 10 more seconds to go. Come on. I know you can do it. Almost there. Anytime it's getting too much for you guys, you know you can. Just walk on the spot. There we go. Release. Put your weights down. All your bottles of wine. Ready? Three, two, give me high knees. You do baby or you go big. Woohoo! That's it. Bring those knees up. We go big or we go home. Nice. Almost there. Keep going. Five. Good. And march it out. Ah. March, grab your water, and I'm gonna give you a second set of exercise. Nice job. I'm gonna grab my weights again, guys. It's optional. I'm gonna do a squat. Okay, what about my timer? Perfect, you get. Ready? Down and up. Squeeze your glutes. Down, exhale up, and squeeze. I can tell, I still feel my shoulders from the last HIIT workout I did on Wednesday. Nice. Love it. So make sure you're keeping the shoulders back. Show me your belly button, guys, because I see a lot of that. You're not bending your knees, you're bending your hips. You're not working your legs at all. Almost there. That's it. 
Good, and release. Ha, 10 second break. Three, two, ready? Open your legs even more. Let's go down and up. Down and up. Contract your glutes. That's it. Woo! Less than halfway there. That's it. Looking good. Come on. What I'm doing, I'm just bringing my weights out of the way when I'm squeezing my glutes. That's why I'm bringing them up a little bit. Good job. And then we're going to go and squat, jumping each side. There we go. We're done. Put your weights down. 10 second break. Ready? Go. Jump each side. Again. 30 seconds. That's it. So when we travel each side, we're working right in your hips. It's good to travel forward and back, side to side. Good job, guys. Almost there. Keep going. That's it, and release. March it out. Grab your water. We'll do it again for the second time. Let's go back to squats, guys. Option not to grab your weights, as you know. And I still have my 15 pounds in each hand. If you're getting tired, you can decrease the amount of weight. My timer is not ready, but I am. Ready, go! Down and up, contract your glutes. Down and up. So open your knees above the ankles. I don't want to see that. That tells me that I need to work more in your outer thigh. That's it. Almost done already. It goes quick. Then we're gonna do the plie. Ready? Get ready, 10 second rest. I'm gonna bring my weights right here in the middle. Go. Down, up, and squeeze your glutes. Good, keep your shoulders down and back. So that's easy to let go, okay? This is what I'm saying. Shoulders down, keep them back. Make sure you're finishing your move by contracting your glutes. That's it. Almost there. And then we're gonna do the squat jump each side. Put your weights down, 10 second rest. Oh. I'm feeling it already. Three, two, ready, go. That's it. Nice. I'm doing it live right now. People with me, live stream. There we go. Woohoo! <laughs> Good job. Four, three, two, and release. And keep moving. Let's grab your water. I'll give you a longer break here. Let's come back for your third set of exercise. We're gonna do a side lunge, guys. So this is it, and we're gonna just keep going with the right leg for now. So grab your weights if you want to, optional. Three, two, let's go. Down and come back. That's it. Just the fact that we are coming back, we are working more in your inner thighs. That's it. Good, bend that right knee. There we go. Nice, keep your hips as well facing me. Your hips are still facing me. Good, one more time. And release, we're gonna switch side. 10 second break. Ready, let's go. Down, let's go to the left. This is just focusing on your legs today. You might be sore. That's okay to be sore a little bit, guys. 
But if you had a few G to get up the toilet, you were too hard. And I think that because it's a reality. Some of my friends are going back to the gym. They are so sore, they had a few to move. Good. And last one. And release. Ah! Put your weights down. 10 minutes break. We're gonna go for the skater. Let's go. So here you jump as high as you want. You decide. That's it. And you can keep it low impact as well. Almost there. Looking good. My heart rate is up. Good. And release. And grab your water. We're going to repeat again. Just keep moving and we'll come back in a few seconds. We're going to go back, guys. Option all to grab your weight. Three, two, let's go. Right leg and come back. Good, shoulders down and back. Again, abs are tight. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's Friday for us. And <laughs> for some reason, it's harder today for me. <laughs> I just feel to stay in bed. Oh. When it's gloomy like that, huh? And release, 10 second break. We're gonna switch your leg. For the left. Oh, three, two, ready? Go. Down and up. That's it. And then cardio. And now we're gonna do deadlifts. I want we work a little bit more your glutes. That's it. Good job. Almost done. Good, one more. That's it. Weights down. And then we're done. No, I'm not. Because I'm going to do this. Okay. Three, two, skater. Let's go. Again, you jump as high as you want. If for you it's Monday or Tuesday, you have more energy than me, go and jump higher. <laughs> That's it, nice. Less than halfway there. Come on. Then we'll take a longer break. Nice. March it out. Good. Let's grab your water. We're gonna bring your heart rate down a little bit. And then we're gonna do deadlifts. And we're done, we're just gonna stretch. Okay, grab your weights. You need weights, so if you don't have weights, grab your bottles of wine, or maybe your cans from your pantry. And we're gonna do a deadlift. Are you ready? Shoulders down and back. Keep your shoulders back, because we're going against gravity. It's normal to drop the shoulders for some people, so you really need to emphasize that. Slightly bend your knees. If you're too tight, the back of your legs, calves and hamstrings. Down to inhale. Exhale up, squeeze your glutes. Again, finish your movement. Up and squeeze. That's it. Let's go again for 10. Nine. So if you have back pain, guys, forget this one. Your body is still not ready. We need to get stronger core. Seven, six, five, four, three, and two. Last one. Yay, that's it. Put your weights down. We're done. There we go, good job guys. Grab your water, grab your mat and let's do the cool down and the stretch. Let's sit on the mat. We're gonna do your calf and hamstrings. Oh, it's 
good though. When we're doing the stretch, that means we're done. And seriously, I'm glowing. Okay, hinge on the hips. Let's come forward. If you don't cannot touch your toes, put your hands here. I want you to sit nice and tall. If not, grab your toes and bring them towards you. So relax your shoulders, relax your arms. That's why I need to do a ponytail, guys. Trust me. Oh. Nice. Now I'm going to fall forward, round your back, only for 10 seconds. Just to stretch your lower back and your entire spine here. To go a little bit deeper in the hamstring calf stretch. Beautiful. Slowly release. Open your legs. I'm gonna stretch your inner thighs. Let's see how flexible you are. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not very flexible here. There we go. So even when I was a gymnast, I was very strong, but I never, I was not flexible. And my coach was pushing on my back. It seems that every time I do this stretch, I see her pushing behind my back. <laughs> oh. Do you feel that stretch? In your inner thighs. Try to come a little bit lower. When we do the inner thigh stretch, it helps for knee pain as well. And slowly come up. Let's do the figure four right here. Cross your right ankle over your left knee and bring your heel closer or your hands closer as well to your glutes, and push your shoulders away from your ears, chest closer to your leg. And you should feel it right in your glutes. On your, that's your piriformis, we're stretching. So just breathe deeply into it. Whew. That's it. So deeper you're gonna breathe, the more you're gonna bring your heart rate down, and quicker as well. That's it, let's stretch your glutes, 10 seconds. So right knee, hug with your left arm, open the chest, drop your shoulder. My right hand is right behind my glutes and I'm looking back above my right shoulder. And slowly release. Let's put your legs while we're here. So hug your knee using your right arm, open the chest and shoulders, look back above your left shoulder. Sit and release. Now we're going to bend the knee right here to stretch your piriformis. So feel the difference as well between both legs. Usually one is tighter than the other one. This is my tightest one, so I can feel I cannot come as close to my glutes or my heel and hands. That's it. So you can hold it for a minute. Good, and let's release, runner lunge. So knee is coming in front of your toes. You're gonna have a little space underneath your heel and I want you to press your heel on the floor. Same with your hip. So shoulders away from your ears, we don't need them. Another one you can hold for a minute. That's it. Watch your back. Don't round your back. I'm just looking slightly in front of my mat. Okay, let's go 290 degrees at your knees. That's the safest way to stretch your quads. Tilt the pelvis under. You're going to feel your hip flexors. Opposite arm up, then your front leg. Let's go side. You might feel the stretch right here as well on the side of your body. That's your lats. Nice. And let's switch your legs. Same thing. Let's come in front. Press your heel on the floor. 
Press your hip flexors as well. Beautiful. Five, four, three, two. Push yourself to 90 degrees at your knees. So tilt your pelvis under. Reach up with your opposite arm. Let's go side. That's it. Keep breathing. Good, and slowly release. Let's stand up. We're gonna do one for the outer thigh, and I really like. So let's cross your right leg over your left. You're gonna let go your right, so your left hip should be higher. You might feel the stretch right here. I'm gonna bring my left arm up, and I'm gonna go deeper into the stretch. I'm gonna go to my right. That's it. So again, we're stretching the side of your body, lats and the hip. And release, let's do the same thing. I'm gonna cross my left leg over my right. Leg over your hip, so your left should be down, your right should be up. Right arm up, let's go, travel to the left. That's it. Breathe. Good, inhale up, exhale and release. Inhale, let's go up. Exhale down, and again, up to inhale. Exhale, one more time, up to inhale. And exhale, and release, good job. There we go, quick and effective workout just for your legs to have muscular legs. See you next time.